My name is Malini Roy. I am the curator of Mughal India Art, Culture and Empire. I'm very lucky to be here to introduce the exhibition, which focuses on the Mughal Empire from the 16th through the 19th century. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to look at these rare manuscripts, paintings and objects of art. The exhibition looks at the portraits of the 15 major Mughal emperors, We've got historic accounts, portraits, as well as intimate glances into the lives of the Mughal emperors. This imperial manuscript, the Book of Akbar, looks at the childhood of the infant Akbar, who was one of the major Mughal emperors. After a three-year separation from his parents, he was reunited, and the scene just captures him seated in the lap of one of the women at the Mughal court. The Mughals were great writers and they commissioned and wrote their own personal memoirs. This manuscript here looks at an episode from the life of the Mughal Emperor Babur, the founder of the Mughal Empire, who was being tended to by physicians during an illness in 1498. And here you can see an instructional poem for pigeon fanciers. It provides information on the care and breeding of pigeons, which was a popular pastime at the Mughal court. This very popular painting features Europeans as painted by Mughal artists. It's a very interesting painting because it's not drawn from life, but from the imagination of Mughal artists. The exhibition not only reveals the lives of the Mughal emperors, but also provides glimpses into their areas of interest, such as the arts, sciences, religion, literature, and reveals why the empire came to a final end. The exhibition will run until April 2nd, 2013.